Most people have one animal phobia or another, be it a fear of sharks thanks to sensationalist blockbusters or a horror of anything that creeps and crawls. But when it comes to which species are worth being afraid of, take a look at these 10 scary creatures caught on camera. <music> 10. Ai. The largest nocturnal primate in the world, the Ai is a lemur from Madagascar characterized by teeth that are of rodents and especially thin and long middle finger. It taps on trees for grubs and gnaws holes in the wood of the tree with its incisors to create small holes. It then inserts its long middle finger into the hole and pulls out grubs. The gremlin-like look is further enhanced by strands of hair here and there and large eyes. There used to be giant eye eyes, an extinct form of the eye eye once lived in southwest Madagascar. It likely weighed between 3 and 5 times what the existing II species weighs, making it over 25 pounds. It probably coexisted with early humans, but it is not clear if human activity contributed to its extinction or not. Nocturnal animals often lead solitary lives, and the II is no exception. According to the American Association of the Advancement of Science AAAS, they spend their days sleeping and nights foraging, rarely socializing with other creatures. Although they have been foraging in pairs, they have not been observed grooming each other like other primates, and their territories hardly overlap, except when males move into a female's dominion. 9. Tarsier The smallest known primate, the Tarsier, has very large and round eyes that appear to be bulging out, and its feet and toes are enormous. The hair on its body has a patchy appearance, which adds to the oddity of its disproportionate appearance, along with large and pointy ears. They jump from tree to tree to catch snakes and birds, even in motion. It is found mostly in Southeast Asia. Taziers have the largest eyes relative to body size of any mammal. Each eyeball is around 16 millimeters in diameter, which is as large as the Taziers' entire brain. The eyes are so large that they can't rotate them. Instead, Taziers can twist their necks a full 180 degrees in either direction, just like owls. They use this ability to wait silently for prey to approach, rather than moving around to hunt. The size of their eyes is likely related to the absence of a reflective layer called a tapetum that's typically found on the eyes of other nocturnal animals. Babies are born with their eyes open, ready to climb trees within an hour of birth. 8. Star-Nosed Mole the star-nosed mole will remind you of Jeff, the gigantic worm-like alien with scary appendages ringing its mouth from Men in Black. This mole from northeastern America and eastern Canada is characterized by 11 pairs of pinky flesh appendages round its snout, forming a star-like structure. They have sensory organs to help it feel its way around and catch vibrations. The body of the mole has thick fur of blackish-brown color. It has scaled feet and a long tail. 7. Naked Mole Rat Also known as the Sand Puppy or Desert Mole Rat, the Naked Mole Rat is an East African rodent that may be confused to have been shaved. The eusocial mammal has unique physical aspects with tiny eyes, thin and short legs, and protruding teeth that seal the lower lip to make it well adapt to underground living. Their almost hairless body is covered with wrinkled skin of pale pink or yellow shade. 6. Wrinkle-Faced Bat this Central American bat species has an unusual shape of the skull, which is quite short and wide, and helps make a wider range of foods edible for the species in comparison to other bats. Their hairless face is covered with convoluted overgrowths of skin, giving its face a wrinkly appearance, which is its distinguishing feature. In case of males, the skin flaps are even more pronounced. Even though it eats fruits, it is not classified as a fruit bat. Despite being classified as a leaf-nosed bat, it does not have a leaf nose. 5. Sphinx Cat This breed of cat has a lack of a furry coat, though it is not truly hairless. Its skin and hair have the same albino pale color, and the coat feels like suede. The Sphinx Cat's skin covering the body is very wrinkly and loose. The cat has a flabby pot belly. It has oversized hairless ears and large lemon-shaped eyes, and the eyebrows and whiskers are sparse or non-existent. Its whip-like tail may have a puff of hair at the tip. Pet owners defend it with the well-defined cheekbones, strong neck, and muscular sphinx-like structure. It is actually from Canada. 4. Purple Frog This Indian frog has a robust and round structure. 
It appears like a bloated and flattened mass of purplish gray. It has an unusually small head and a peculiar pointed snout. Its legs and arms are splayed out and short. Its hoarse cry resembles the clucking of a chicken. It has oral suckers like rephilic fish. While the breeding habits of the frog are still secretive, scientists believe that the burrowing frog spends most of the year underground. Then for two weeks when monsoon season hits, it comes up and gets down in temporary ponds. It's a lot like the creature from the Black Lagoon, except a whole lot nicer. Despite all the significant amphibian wealth in the region, these animals hardly receive any public attention. Unlike the larger charismatic mammals, even among nature enthusiasts, it is only recently that people have started paying them notice. From the general public, frogs are ugly-looking, creepy croakers with slimy or warty skin that sometimes take refuge in their shoe racks, bathrooms, or gardens. For the common person, frogs and toads, nature's best pest control agents, are just good-for-nothing animals. The fact that a frog's diet consists of a diverse set of insects is seldom appreciated. When trying to seek the attention of policymakers or the public to protect an area for this amphibious diversity or in an individual species, one always receives a baffled look. Without addressing this, we cannot successfully conserve a species, especially a species like the purple frog, which is largely distributed outside the protected area network. It was at this juncture that we realized how generating awareness is as important as research and conservation. 3. Mata Mata The Mata Mata turtle from Amazon has a body that resembles the bark of a tree to help it camouflage itself. It is quite large and has a head that is triangular and flattened. The head is characterized by tubercles, skin flaps, and a horn on the long tube-like snout. The chin has three barbells and the upper jaw has four. The pastron or shell is deeply notched at the rear and has narrow bridges. There are small flaps of skin that fringe the long neck. The turtle also has five webbed claws. 2. Thorny Dragon Also known as the Thorny Lizard, Mountain Devil, Thorny Devil, and Moloch, the Thorny Dragon is an Australian lizard with its body covered with hard conical spikes to discourage predators, as well as ridges to collect water from any body part. The ridges and spikes together give it quite an intimidating look, enhanced by a false head at the back of its neck, which it presents before the predator, while dipping its real head between its legs as a form of defense. 1. Satanic Leaf-Tailed Gecko This gecko from Madagascar is also known as the eyelash leaf-tailed gecko. It has a flat tail that resembles the shape of a leaf. Some of them have notches that give the appearance of a decaying leaf. Some also have spines on their head, body, and trunk. Their eyes, which have no lids, have a projection above them that look like eyelash. All these adaptions help the animal in camouflage and, in the process, give it an ugly look. The satanic leaf-tailed gecko is a small species of gecko that can be found only on the island of Madagascar. The gecko occurs in a variety of colors, including hues of purple, orange, tan, and yellow, but is often molted brown, with small black dots on the underside that help to distinguish it from similar species. It has long spines on the head, body, and trunk. The tail is flattened and has a leaf-like appearance. Some geckos even have notches in their tails to further mimic a decaying leaf, and this trait seems more common in the males of the species. In addition, the satanic leaf-tailed gecko has an eyelash-like projection above each eye. During daylight hours, these adaptions help the gecko blend into its surroundings. At night, it helps the gecko hunt for prey by providing camouflage. The main threats to satanic leaf-tailed geckos include habitat destruction, forestation, and collection from the pet trade. Studies suggest that leaf-tailed geckos can only inhabit a very specific environment and are not tolerant of any degradation of their natural habitat. This makes them vulnerable to the impacts of habitat degradation and harvesting, a common problem due to it being popular pets. At present, satanic leaf-tailed geckos are known to occur in at least three protected areas, Saratanana Strict Nature Reserve, Morjiv Natural Park, and Anjana Haribe Special Reserve. However, Illegal harvesting is known to occur even within protected areas. Do share with us in the comments if you know about more such creatures. Thanks for watching.